What's up, peeps? It's your girl, Queen L. Eats. Whoop, whoop, whoop. And this is Tweezy Flex. And today, Tweezy cooked for Labor Day, y'all. So, we got some hot dogs. We got some wings. We got some drumsticks. Some boneless, uh, skinless thighs. Some lean burgers. We got me a ribeye. Got a ribeye steak over there. Thing looking good. I don't know why it's over there. Though. I might need to slide it over here. No. We got yeah. some baked beans right here. Mm-hmm. This... Got a drinky drink. Oh, I'm pouring the baked beans. Oh, the plate hungry. She's mm -hmm. trying to feed the plate. Mm-hmm. All right. Some vegetarian baked beans. Let's say I pray and get it in. Heavenly Father, bless over this food. Let it be nourishment to our bodies. Bless over the hands that prepared it. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. How y'all doing? How y'all feeling? What's going on, everybody? We hope good. Boom, boom, boom. You know what? I'm going to eat this hot dog first. Queen L did a little something different. I wasn't in the kitchen, so I don't know what she put in it, but I got a little mm, taste. I like it. All right, Tweezy bought me this. He said, I can have a treat today. <laughs> <laughs> so, got me a Pepsi Zero, zero sugar. And yeah, yeah, I know I love my water, but he just like, hey, I want you to try this out. It's really good. <laughs> Chili good. The angle, ask her what she put in. And Jean said, This is good. Got a little kick to it. Small little kick. Small little kick. Still sweet, little sweet. Got a little bit of everything up in here. That's what I wanted. Oh my goodness. Let me help start eating. I'm okay. I'm about to take your hot dog. You over there pouring that drink. You about where the hot dog get? I don't know. You were thirsty. Mm-hmm. That's good. That's really good. And she can't tell it's good. Now, do you remember what you put in? I know a lot of times we be playing around with stuff, and then when we get done, we be like, oh my goodness, what did I put in it? I remember. You remember? So anything carbonated gives me the hiccups. Make me burp. Mm. So honey mustard, fat free. Come on, come on, that kind of slowy, slowy. There we go. Are y'all enjoying yourself on this beautiful Labor Day? Beautiful, hot Labor Day? I'm looking like him. See, I'm looking just like James Brown. <laughs> when he was hot. I'm James Brown. Don't do that. <laughs> Listen, when that movie, when that movie came out, was it Ch did Chapman play James Brown? Mm -hmm. He kept saying, I'm James Brown. Right, and head. I said it all day in the house. Hey, <laughs> Cornell be walking in the kitchen. I'll be like, I'm James Brown. I'll be like, please <laughs> stop it now. <laughs> <laughs> Not now, but right now. Stop right now. Ooh, it got that fat. Don't trim that fat. I smell that fat. Oh, man, this smells good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, don't I don't even need no steak sauce. You know the steak good when you don't need no steak sauce. Go. Go, 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 go. Mm. Looking over here at my steak. Remember, you wanted a burger. It is true. Mm. 
These baked beans so good. What is chicken good? Chicken thighs. Got me dancing while I'm eating. <laughs> They like Miss Piggy. Mm. Y'all, when I put knocking dust in the thumbnail or on the title, this one come out. Really knocking dust. Mm hmm. My kid just got done knocking dust. Mm -hmm. But they were being picky though. I fixed all of them the hot dog, chicken, and beans. So AJ, um, he didn't want the hot dog. He wanted the chicken, but he wanted me to break up the chicken in pieces to eat it. Adrian, she didn't want the chicken, but she wanted the hot dog. So she ended up eating two hot dogs instead of chicken. And then Kenzie, she didn't want the hot dog. She just wanted all chicken, so she took Adrian chicken. <laughs> and they bought chicken wings. They said they worked it out. They worked it out. <laughs> <laughs> and Leah had everything. And Leah had everything. <laughs> Ooh. That chicken good, the steak good, and beans good, the hot dog good. This Pepsi, it's got zero sugar, but it tastes more sweet than it do tough. I like a tough Pepsi. Yeah, I love that burp. Trying to slow down, eat fast, get full fast, <sighs> breathe. Mm -hmm. These baked beans slimy, y'all. Mm. So cook this up, but also the meal prep for the next three days using the infamous crock pot. Threw a whole pack of chicken breasts in there, some zucchini, some squash, asparagus. Then I add rice to it later on. And it should be enough for like three meals for three days. That's good though. You meal prepping it. Now you gotta got your lunch. Mm -hmm. oh I know everything's so good. You did that, baby. Thank you, thank you. The kids want you to take them for a walk around the neighborhood so they can ride on their scooter. I'm doing that the way. It's too hot. <laughs> way too hot. <clears throat> so how about, I read that, uh, let's see if I can find it on my phone. Here we go. A third grade teacher was arrested for allegedly being drunk on the first day of school. She didn't feel like being bothered. She threw some shots back. <laughs> Ooh -wee. She said, you know what? <laughs> These children ain't gonna aggravate me today. See, not when that summer be over. Uh -uh. First day of school. <laughs> 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 she said, they're gonna be hype and aggravate me. <laughs> I gotta go ahead and get ready for them. <laughs> So how about this? Tell us um, your age 
without telling us by telling us what was your first cell phone. Mm. And how old you were when you got your cell phone? Well, no. I had to buy my own. I had to buy my own. I was 18. And I got on a singular wireless phone. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Singular wireless. And I had a Nokia phone. Them old Nokias. <laughs> Them old ones, they look like spaceship. Cause I had to get one of you had the You had the blue one. I forgot what color. I think it was black. Yours was a flip though, was it? It was just a, just the phone. See, my first, my first one was a flip Nokia. See? They had to flip, but I couldn't afford to flip. <laughs> so I had to get the, just the straight one that looked like an alien phone. And I had to text, like, mashing A, B, B, A, B, C, like that. I had to text that way. Oh, same same thing. It wasn't nothing special about the flip, but you flip. And I had a beeper, too. I had a um, green beeper that was... It was powered by Radio Shack, so I had to pay my bill at Radio Shack. Radio Shack, man. Mm -hmm. And more Radio Shacks. And I ain't. I'm done, you know, Will. I ain't seen Radio Shack in a long time. Mm -hmm. When I was a flute Nokia and I was 17. Oh, okay. Uh, cooking up that fish. Long John Silvers. Mm, cooking fish at Long John Silvers. I'm trying to think of what my job was. I forgot. I had a deck of jobs. I guess so that question. I got it off the Ballers Alert Instagram page. Okay. That page got everything on it. A lot of uh, good and bad. <laughs> like a lot of other pages. <laughs> yeah. What's one thing someone can do on a first date that make you ghost them? On the first date. Be ugly with a waiter, a waitress. Yes. Snap on a waitress, have an attitude, have a, be nasty, anything like that. Because um, you don't know me either. So you snap on them, you gonna snap on me too. That's how I feel about it. So, nah. I gotta, I gotta watch how you treat people first. <laughs> And on top of that, you don't care about my food. Exactly. You don't care nothing about what I take in my body. <laughs> you snapping on people. Who you got to bring, bring my, my food, food out? Mm -mm. And that's the worst thing. I cannot stand it to go out yeah. with people that send food back all the time or get an attitude and stuff. Honey, that's okay. I don't on the drive, Or getting an attitude to drive through before you pick up your food. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I can't stand it. I'd be like, you know what? Just cancel my order. You cancel just cancel mine. You keep yours. But uh, yeah. And I don't even want them to see my. Yeah, that's why. I'm going to tell you the truth about something. That's why I be so scared sometimes to do these reviews and say exactly what I be thinking. Because get what? If I went to it, it's near me and I might go back. <laughs> and they might see my video. Excuse me. They might see my video. So. I might start going into disguise, putting on <laughs> disguises when I do my reviews. That way I can get down and dirty with y'all. That'd be good, won't it? You're going to do a whole new page. Huh? What page you going to post it on? I'm going to post it on this one. And then all they got to do is what? Oh. <laughs> Just go back a couple videos. <laughs> That's her. <laughs> what? Never mind. That's not going to work. That's not going to work. Maybe a whole new secret page. It'd be for the hardcore fans. You send like a hidden message. 
Like this is the real, this is the pay you I give it up, give it up. Yep. <laughs> yep. But starting over, y'all, yeah, that's real hard to do. Yeah. Starting from scratch. Whew. Yeah, I know when up the ball alert page. What's up? If your partner is a pet lover and you're totally against them, would you question your future? <sighs> Depending on what type of pet lover it is, I mean. Because it's levels to pet lovers. It's levels. If, if you think that I'm ready to have dogs and cats running all over the house and that's not who I am, that's not who the way I was raised, and that's not something I want, but that's what you want, it's not going to work. It's just not. Same. If you got, you know, some people let the dog lick their face and lick the mouth, and I, and I'm sitting up here looking at y'all. I'm being a little extreme, but I'm being for real. It's not extreme. They they do that. Yeah, if you with this woman, you a man, and you you like dogs, you like cats, but you don't want them in your personal space. You don't want them in your house. And she know I want my dogs and cats, and then. They kissing her all in the mouth and face and all that and all over. And you looking at her like, oh, it ain't work. But if he feels the same way she do, and y'all all one big happy family hugging <laughs> and kick pets and let them kiss y'all in the mouth, then it'll work out. <laughs> I'm just being real. I'm glad we're on the same page. They're the same page. We love animals. We will take care of them. We'll help them or whatever they need. But we don't want any in the house. Any house pets. We don't. That's the agreement we have. I can't say that'll be forever the case, but. I got them kids. What you what you say them kids saw the other day? When y'all went to pet smart? Hamsters. <laughs> Hamsters. Honey, our kids went and pet smart. They went crazy over them house. I said, honey, that thing been got out. And it, I think it's a rat. They said, they said, oh, it's so cute. I said, yeah, it's cute to get out that cage. You get out that cage. It ain't cute no more. Because mm -mm. <laughs> if I don't know what it is. Because if you sleep in, that little thing is looking at you. <laughs> Look, give me a kiss. <laughs> if you don't get out of my bed. You, was, you going to scream so so hard. Yeah, ain't no point in scaring me like that. Mm -mm. Mm. Can't do it. Y'all, we hope y'all enjoyed our video because we enjoyed making this video for y'all. So, if you would, would you like, share, and subscribe? Hit that notification bell to be notified. Mm -hmm. Upload our new video.